Hey guys, what is up, and welcome back. So, this is Minecraft, as you can probably tell. And I was curious about something. If you were actually stranded on, you know, in just the wilderness, on an island, something like that, how accurate actually is Minecraft? So... We're going to figure that out. So say for example, this. It's wood. It's a tree. You cannot take your bare hand and beat the hell out of a tree. A branch? Yes. So like leaves, branches, you can break that stuff with your bare hands. Uh, grass, you can break that with your bare hands, but wood you cannot. So we're going to see if we can actually survive um, in Minecraft and see if how real it actually is. So obviously, real scenario, no monsters. So we're going to do this. So apparently survival, you need to uh, do this, whatever. Um... So you can obviously dig up sand with your bare hands. So sand is 100% fair game. Uh, dirt, you can dig that out with your bare hands as well. So dirt, fair game. But you cannot use sand or dirt to break a tree. Unfortunately. But dirt, fair game. That is 100% fair game. Now, obviously, when you're out in the wilderness, 22 is okay for now. You don't have an infinite amount of storage on you, obviously. There we go. We're going to break grass. Eventually you're going to get some seeds. You can pull grass out of the lawn with your bare hands. You can do that. So that's fair game. So it really is, if you actually use real life tactics, can you survive? Leaves, branches, like I said, you can break those. That's fair. Uh, I also have it on peaceful. So I have it on survival. I have it on peaceful, which I believe means no monsters. So did you guys watch that uh, new episode of Loki? Uh, as of recording this, it's the day they let out, or I guess the night of the day, uh, they, they released Loki, uh, episode four. I got an apple! Look at that! I've gotten saplings, which is fine, you can plant trees. That's like getting an acorn or something, you know? Oh yeah, by the way, also, physics does not have to operate the same, because obviously in Minecraft... They don't. Also, say I fall, right? If I were to fall. Real life, broken leg, broken ankle. Minecraft yields a bit of health. As long as you have full food, you'll be fine. Ooh, I got a stick. Yes, the first of many. So, like, that's what I'm talking about. In real life, that's like, okay, that's finally a useful sized branch. I got two. Okay, so this is the tree I want. How did you get in here, little guy? Now, here's going to also be the thing. In theory, can you kill a pig with your bare hands? Yes. You 
could. That thing's a baby, though. It's very little use to me, as of right now. And technically, I'm actually supposed to be using my bare hands here. But, bare hands and bare hands covered in dirt, or holding dirt, I suppose is, you know, has around the same effectiveness. That's a sapling. Give me another stick. I think I need four to make an axe. Because then I'll make an axe, I can chop wood. Let's see. In theory, could you break a tree with a stick? I'll tell you what. I'll give you this. In theory, if you were to take out all the dirt surrounding a tree, what would that tree do? It would topple over. Because said tree toppled over, Oh, no, you know what? That still doesn't mean you can cut it. That just means the top stuff at the top would be fair game. Could break. Alright, we're going to stretch it a little bit here. This is what we're going to do. We have... A tree. We dug out all the dirt around it that tree then as it's starting to topple over breaks or part of it breaks off on impact with the ground and therefore we're able to get a little bit of wood to use like I said we're stretching it a little bit here Okay. We are going to stretch it, but only by a little bit. Um, let's put the chest here. Yeah, that tree when it toppled over gave me two broken pieces. Just saying. Now, with my axe that I made from wood that had fallen, the two pieces that broke off, one when it was tipping, one when it hit the ground, uh, the axe now allows me to um, harvest more wood because I'm cutting with an axe. Because this sounds legit. And if you're wondering, yes. You can stack dirt in real life. You can make a pile of dirt. Therefore, now granted, a pile of dirt only gets you so far, but that's still legit. I think. Oop, found another stick. I think for right now, I'm good on what I have. So, number one thing is going to be make sure I have a food source. You know, I have a, obviously I have water. Now, Minecraft, water don't matter that much. It really doesn't matter that much. But, food is important. Now, here's also the thing, in theory, that should do it. Alright, uh, while it is not a machete, or sword, or any kind of knife, it is sharp, and that means an axe could definitely cut sugarcane. Ooh. Fish meat. Aha! I mean, otherwise, you just use your axe. So I want to cook the salmon. Wood burns quick, but salmon cook quick.
Okay. We now have food. But it's not reliable. It's not consistent. And actually, this is pretty good because this is almost like a desert island kind of thing. So. I do know that to make a bucket, you need um, steel or iron. Iron you get from iron ore, which is back down there. Wait, Mr. Turtle. Wait, I want to kill you. Boy, that escalated quickly. Wait, did I just kill a turtle for nothing? You're an idiot. Yeah, they didn't bury their eggs. You suck, you jackass. All right, so let's do a little recap. I don't have a shelter, but wood. You can use that wood to make a shelter. I found apples from the trees, which... Those are a little bit of a one-off, but I have the saplings to grow more trees and, in theory, get more apples. I went, killed a fish, got his meat, and cooked it. Using the wood. So, by replanting the trees, that's an endless supply of wood. <laughs> then I continue to harvest the food around me, eat that, and... You know, I'd eventually get, like, a farming system, get better with the sugar cane, all that stuff. But I would be able to survive just on this little island. Now, would it be a life of luxury? No. No, if you're stranded in the wild or on some deserted island, it's never going to be a life of luxury. More survivors! Hello, sir! I know if I kill you, your llamas are going to be very, or alpacas, they will be very mad at me. But, um, yeah. Would you like a fish? Oh, wow. Anyway, so, could you survive just on this tiny little island? Yes, you could. So, that's really the point of the video. Now, you could definitely clear out more dirt, do whatever you want, and you can say, you know, yay, you're really doing well for yourself. You have an entire island to use. Um, but you can live just off the island and the surrounding area. Farming may not be great because you're um, going to have a hard time finding seeds something like this, that's grass. Okay? You're going to be able to get plenty of that. Okay, bye! Safe travels. Um, and then anything that I can find in the water is mine for the taking. This is just like seaweed. So. But, yeah. Anything is fair game. I can go capture fish. Every once in a while, some guy's gonna show up for a few minutes and then leave. Oh, his thing wants to stay. But, um... You know, it's... It's not easy, but it's also 100% possible that you're able to survive. Oh, I missed some wood. But yeah, 100% possible for you to survive. Did I miss some wood? Yeah, you know what? I did. Uh, that's why these are still standing, because there's wood in there. Um, so, that was the point of the video. Asking, can you survive in Minecraft as if you were actually in real life? As long as, you know, you had the necessary knowledge 
capabilities and tools, yes. Because that's the thing. I started by just, you know, grabbing sand and dirt with my hands and breaking leaves and branches and grass. And here we are. Now, we did have to stretch it a little bit for that tree. But in theory, by digging around the tree, that tree falls. It could break in a couple places. And that's usable wood. So I am going to leave this episode here. If you guys enjoy this, please leave a like. If new channel, please hit that subscribe button and turn notifications on. See you guys next video. Later.